Hey everyone, I have just had dinner because I couldn't make a video before I'd eaten something. I was pretty smashed today after our first Spring Classics race on Le Het Newsblad, which is in Belgium and it starts and finishes in Ghent. And it was 120 kilometers today with uh, about eight climbs and five major cobbled sections. It was really fast paced today. The first 45 kilometers was pretty flat and into a headwind, but the bunch was still rolling really fast but staying all together and it's always really nervous. Everyone's ready for the upcoming hard sections and there's lots of near misses, lots of near crashes and yeah, everyone, there's about 180 girls so it's a big, big start uh, bunch for us. Uh, once you get through that, uh, then the climbs start and my goal today was to get through the first bunch of climbs with the front group and then use my strength in the cobble sections after that. So. I pushed myself a lot and stayed with the leaders over the the main climbs at the start and I was pretty happy with that but lost a bit of positioning coming into the famous Paderberg, uh, I've got a lot in my throat still from the race. Um, so that's a, a steep cobble climb that we do in the classics like Flanders and there's a, a gutter that you can ride up in the side for this race. And um, there was a lot of girls slipping and sliding, so I climbed up on the cobbles, but I was not quite in contact with the main rider, so I had to spend a lot of energy to get back there to help Emma out, and from then on I was just suffering all day, so I kind of kept getting dropped in the, the steep climbs and making my way back through the flat sections and then getting dropped again. So yeah, it was not the best day for me, but I just made sure I didn't give up and tried to help Emma as much as I could. It was just two of us up there in that main front group. So yeah, I told her with about 30k to go that I was I was suffering a lot and I would try and do what I can, but she had to attack in the next cobble section. That was her decision and it was a good one, but unfortunately she didn't have any allies in there to help her bring the two leaders back before the finish, which was Anna van der Breggen and Ellen van Dyke. So they were really strong today, so well done. Congrats for them for the podium. And um, the whole Balls Dormans team was super strong, so they really put everyone on the back foot today. And we kind of expected that, but to see it happening out on the road is pretty tough. And so they're going to be the ones to watch this season. But yeah, it's really good to get through this first big race and... Yeah, I'm pretty happy um, with how I went today, even though I didn't get the result that I was hoping for. I was still quite strong in some areas, and there's definitely other areas that I know I can keep working on. Um, and now we have three days of rest before the next race in Belgium. So I'll keep you updated after I finish that one. So thanks for following.